Good morning, friends, and it's April 12, 2019. I work with uh, Quakers in different capacities over the years. Uh, in the meeting context, we've had our committees, and uh, we still have our committees, and I'll be on those sometimes. And then I worked for AFSC, American Friends Service Committee, initially in the 80s when Portland was getting a lot of refugees. Now, we might be getting some more refugees. Um, there's a concerted effort to send them to Portland because this is a sanctuary city. And that's a business for us. We have Mercy Corps here and plans to actually do some camps, not just for refugees from foreign countries, but refugees from America, all the, all the Americas. Like it doesn't matter which side of what border you're coming from. A refugee is a refugee. It could be from um, economic crisis, opioid epidemic, um, weather, floods, you need somewhere to go, so you're seeking asylum. Now these are just English words, to, to be seeking refuge, you're a refugee seeking refuge, you're seeking asylum. I'm not going to say what's legal and what's not, I just know those are English words and I'm entitled to use them. And so when I talk about refugees, I'm not going to go look it up in a law book, because I learned that meaning long before I gave my authority to lawyers to tell me what things mean, right? It's not their job to tell me my language. So yeah, refugees coming to Oregon, and then there's refugees already out there, not in Oregon, that we supply, right, with educational materials in one way or another as Quakers. So like, we've got reading materials, this one's been popular, that could go all over the world, right? It's a little bit out of date, you know, I could I could see doing another edition of this one. Actually, it would be great as a cartoon. And you put it on a big screen, like you just have to hang a sheet, if nothing else, in a camp, and you let everyone in the camp who wants to watch videos. In fact, education is what to be doing in the camps. Watching videos is a big part of it. So any refugee camp designed in the state of Oregon should probably have some pretty good theater more than one, right? We're going to like build it around kind of the rock star, you know, the rock festival model. That's the model of a permanent country fair refugee camp, whatever you want to call it. And yeah, it could be a disaster. So it's not like we want to hide it from public. We're going to have a lot of critiques, a lot of journalists. It's going to be the kind of thing that takes the attention away from some of the bozos who want us to like lick their weapons and fetishize and see how how cool we think jets are. Ooh, stroke, stroke, right? That's what they want. Military porn might have to take a back seat to what we're doing here. That's okay, though. That's what Quakers prefer. And regarding BDS, I just wanted to end with this. There is another approach, which my uh, one of my associates got really into, uh, which is the carrot mob. And that's the idea that he had to uh, reward a Hot Lips pizza down the street for putting solar panels on the, on the roof. I don't know how far that got. Did they ever put the solar panels? But anyway, it was let's all buy pizza from them so they can budget for that. And that's the kind of thing, proactively purchase from versus avoid purchasing from. If you got money left over, like I don't practice personally, any any kind of concerted BDS myself, but I'm just I'm just me. I really don't care what I do in a lot of ways. So big deal, right? But anyway, think about investing, rewarding, putting your money proactively in things you support, as opposed to always trying to punish people. Uh, there's a big punish mentality around here. Everyone's supposed to go to jail. Throw them in jail. Throw them in jail. And then they then they complain about how the jails are full and there's too many people in jail. Like punishment, if you go around in life thinking of punishments for a lot of people, you might want to check that. You might want to get some get some help. All right, talk to you soon.